everyone, thank you for coming back to my channel. I'm Stephanie, if you're new here, I do air fryer videos on Friday or every other Friday, depending on when I can get them all for you guys. But today I had a requested video for us to do or to try out some Twinkies and Oreos in the air fryer. So we are going to be using croissant rolls for this today and spray. So you're gonna need spray, Twinkies, Oreos, and croissant rolls. That's pretty much all you need. And I will show you how to wrap them and what you need to set your air fryer to. So this is just gonna be an extra yummy treat. Um, my kids are gonna probably like this one. We've never tried this before, so I'm excited to like do this one and see what it's gonna taste like. Um, but I think I'm going to start with the Oreos first. I'm gonna go ahead and preheat my air fryer at 375 for three minutes. So while I get started, I'm gonna um, preheat and then I'll come back. Okay, so now that my air fryer is preheated, I'm gonna get started and open up my croissants and I will show you what you need to do to get started. I have my Oreos open. So like if you were to make your croissants, you're going to take your triangle. It's gonna be a little bit different with the Twinkies, but for the Oreos, you're just gonna take your triangle, you're gonna put your Oreo right in the center, and then you're just going to wrap it all in there. And what you need to try to do is uh, cover everything. Don't let there be any gaps or anything around your Oreo. So if you want, you could probably um, push them out just a little bit so that you guys can uh, roll them up a little bit easier. So that's what that looks like. I'm gonna bring you guys closer and I will show you um, what you need to do with that. Spray the inside of the tray just so that they don't stick in there. So I'm gonna show you a little closer what we're gonna do. So I think I'm just gonna, you could probably use a roller too to flatten these out a little bit more, but this is just what I'm gonna do. Okay, so just bring your corners and your sides and bring it all in. You don't want your Oreo to um, show. So just go like that. I'm going to go and finish up here and I will come back. Okay, so now that I have all my Oreos wrapped, I got eight out of the package because there's eight croissant rolls in a package. So now we're gonna go ahead and spray our Oreos. We are going to flip them halfway in between our cooking time. Okay, so we need to cook these at 375 for four minutes, but we're gonna cook them for two minutes, flip them, and then cook them for another two minutes. Okay, so my Oreos are done. I'm going to plate them up and we are gonna top them with powdered sugar. Okay, so I'm gonna put powdered sugar on these. And that's it. And I'm gonna give these a try. My kids are waiting right here. They're gonna, are you excited? Do they look yummy? I've never tried this before, so we'll see how they taste. It tastes pretty good, it's pretty weird. I don't think I'm gonna share these with any of my children. What is this, the Oreo? Yeah. Is this the Oreo? Mm-hmm. 
You'll probably see a bunch of little hands grabbing all my Oreos. Don't pump it. Don't, don't pump it. It's weird that they're soft. I know, right? They they taste like um like a what are them things that you get? They have like the cream in the middle. Yeah, something like that. That's what they taste like. They're pretty good. Aren't they good? They're different. Mm. Okay, so I'm going to finish this up and then we're going to come back and we're going to make the Twinkies in the air fryer. So I'm excited to try that one. That one's going to be fun too. So I'll be right back. All right, so we are going to move on to the Twinkies right now. Just remember that if you guys are doing back-to-back -back, um, things in your air fryer, my air fryer is really hot right now, so the next batch that I put in is gonna be a little hotter. The recipe is 320 for seven minutes, so because mine is hot, I'm gonna cut back on the time a little bit um, and probably go like maybe four to five minutes and then go from there and see if I need to cook them a little bit longer. But. Um, we're just gonna try it out for that, or just try it out like that for right now. So I'm gonna open up my next roll of croissants, except for this time, you're going to use two per Twinkie instead of the Oreos, it was one per Oreo. All right, I'm gonna bring you guys, oh goodness. Okay, I'm gonna bring you guys a little closer. Okay. So, okay, so you're gonna lay them out just like that, and then you wanna kind of push in the seam together. You don't want to have a seam, you want your whole Twinkie to be covered. I'm just gonna wrap them in there and then just fold in. All right, so you're just gonna wanna fold in the ends. So I'm gonna put that right there and then I'm gonna roll this out and do it again. So I'm not gonna get as many as before with the Oreos, but that's okay. So you're just gonna need extra packages if you want to make so many at a time. Just roll it up. And then fold in bands. I'm gonna spray my tray again, and I have four Twinkies out of that croissant package. All right, oops. My air fryer to 320. And I'm not gonna cook it, like I said, as long as it should be, so we are gonna start out with five minutes and then I'll check it halfway so then I'll just check and see if I need to add more time to it okay so my Twinkies are done I'm gonna give these a try and my kids are also gonna try these after I am done so we're gonna see how this is gonna taste you could probably do anything with the top you could put like Nutella on top with some sugar or whatever but otherwise with the powdered sugar and stuff on there it'll be pretty good with that too so These are pretty good too. I think I like the Oreos better though. All right, so hopefully you guys liked today's video. That was really fun to try out. Um, my kids are right here waiting to try these out also. If you have any other ideas for me to cook in the air fryer, just leave them in the comments down below. Otherwise, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Finally. Okay.